Okay guys, so now that we understand the baseball bat choke and the grips, I'm sure you're wondering if you can apply it from bottom from knee on belly. Probably not at all, but we're gonna do it. So the baseball bat choke is super popular from bottom. It's actually the only choke I've ever been put to sleep from because I had no idea what was going on. I thought I was passing the guard. I thought I took the guy's back and he had the choke like this and I was just on his back and all of a sudden I, I have no idea what happened. So it's something that we've seen really high level guys get put to sleep with. I like to reference matches. You could look at Majid Hage versus Clark Gracie. Uh, Majid Gorilla Hands Hage put him to sleep with the baseball bat choke. So it's, it's the real deal. And a lot of people do it from bottom. And I actually will apply it from bottom from knee on belly. Very seldom, but I do do it. And it's a really fun choke. Sometimes when you're rolling, you just want to have fun. So if you're able, move back this way a little bit more. If you're able to get the grips, okay? Maybe you're trying to finish here. Maybe you don't think you can. A really fun way to finish. And I say fun because I would never, ever, ever do this in a competition. That's just me personally. I have top position. I wouldn't sacrifice my top position to get put on bottom and to get put on bottom in an inferior position if he gets up. But if we're training in the gym and I'm rolling with Ty, this is super easy to choke. I'll just roll over my shoulder. I'm just kidding, guys. Ty's super tough. I'm going to roll over my right. <laughs> I'm going to roll over my right shoulder. Okay, look, look, look. Right shoulder. Ty follows, follows. I turn, 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 turn. And guys, I finish right here, right? I'm lifting this elbow up as I pull. Let's turn this way. I have to keep turning, right? I'm lifting this elbow up as I pull and I finish the choke right here. If I stop here, Ty's just gonna get side control or he's gonna arm bar me, right? So it's gonna be a really, really, really bad, bad, bad time for me. That's why I would, Realistically, I would never do this in a competition because if you don't do it perfect, you're done. So again, I'm here. I honestly wouldn't do this on somebody who's much, who's more experienced or, you know, a competitor because it's, it's, you're risking a lot. But if you're just trying to have fun, it does work. I promise. I hit it. I hit it very seldom, but I do hit it. And when I go for it and I go hard, it works. So again, I'm here. I'm trying to get the choke and I throw them off. I just roll over. And I come to here and I get the choke. So super fun choke, a little gimmicky. Uh, I'm sure some people will uh, advise against it, maybe, but it works and it's fun. So try it out. Let me know what you think.